Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So, today I have a Dollarama haul for you, but it's from a new store. Um, I was at the mall looking for some items for uh, my son's 100th day at school. He's supposed to dress like an old man. Um, while I was there, I went to Children's Place and I did find this hat. So he's going to wear that. Um, I got some white uh, hairspray at a Halloween store and he's going to use that for his hair. Uh, we did a, I'll show you my um, test picture of it. So we have the white hair going on, on there. <laughs> so he's going to have that. Um, but while I was there, I noticed in the, in the mall, uh, above where Old Navy is, there was a Dollarama that was never there before. So, or at least that I'd never noticed before. So. I was like, that's, you know, because it's really close to me. It's actually closer than some of the other ones that I go to. So I thought, well, while I'm here, I'm going to go in and check it out. I have to say this store, I think it's pretty new because the shelves were, some of the shelves weren't stocked, but the items on the shelves were really neat and it looked really organized and it didn't look messy and picked through. And so I think it's still fairly new and not a lot of people realize it's there. So I'm going to get into what I found. A lot of new things that I didn't, that I haven't found at other stores yet. So I was pretty excited about that. Um, I found these over the knee socks for St. Patrick's Day. I absolutely love these. Um, they're $3 each. They had a green pair, but I liked the white with the clovers the best, so I got that. Um, and it's for four to, four to 10 shoe size. Ugh, tongue tied. Got some more uh, St. Patrick's Day stuff. I found these um, suspenders. My son need, you know, we were gonna put suspenders on him for the uh, 100th day. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna use these, but I got them as a just in case because, you know, tacky suspenders. I mean, that's the, that's the quote unquote epitome of old man, right? Is tacky suspenders, so. I wanted to get this. These were $3.50. Way cheaper than anywhere else I'm going to get suspenders. I couldn't find them in any other store other than the Halloween store. And they're $10 there for just a plain color. So I was happy to find this. Um, hoping it will work. We'll see. If, if nothing else, my husband can wear this to work for St. Patrick's Day. Got some glitter body stickers not going to use it for that but thought that these were pretty cute can use them for other things and these were a dollar 25 for 17 pieces i found these stickers that i had not seen yet you've got let's see there we go you've got these green owls and uh, they're metallic and they're $1.25. You've got the clovers, but you've also got the uh, triquetra, quatra. I don't know how to say it exactly. I can see it in my head, but pronouncing it's another story. But you have all these different ones that are just, I mean, so pretty. I love these. You've got one made out of hearts. It's gorgeous. I love this. 
So definitely like that one. And again, $1.25. And then you've got the leprechauns and the rainbows, the pots of gold. So I grabbed that. Those are the only three sets that I found um, for that type of sticker. I found these body stickers as well. Again, can use it for anything else. And there's 25 pieces for $1.25. And then I got these good luck coins, it says spread the luck, um, 18 pieces for $1.25. And it just says the same thing. It says a four leaf clover for good luck. So I grabbed two bags. Thought, you know, could be good if I do a pocket letter or something like that. I got... <clears throat> Got another basket because the basket I got for the little nook in my hallway was too big. So I got a skinnier one and longer. Um, so I'm hoping it will fit. And these, there's two of them for $1.50. If nothing else, I can use it in one of my kitchen drawers for storage. I found bunch of fans I mean a ton of fans but of course I wanted to get the purple one some of them were broken so I had to kind of pick through until I found one that was uh, not broken because the little back here they were kind of broken off but um, you know it's a cheap little fan dollar fifty I don't expect much out of it it's just four on hot days so there we go. I found these adhesive rhinestones. Had never seen these in any of the stores that I go to. Um, so I got one of each package. So you've got this set. You've got this set. And this one. And these are $1.25. It's, there's two sheets in each one, so that's good. Another item I found um, more of the cupcake paper, but these are ladybugs. Did not see these in the other store, so I thought this was pretty cute. This can work for Valentine's Day or for pretty much anything else. Um, the ladybugs have hearts on them, so I think it's pretty cute, but Again, $60 for $1.25, you can't beat that. Something new that I found, not new to most people, but new to me because I have never seen these in my stores, ever. But I finally found the layered stamp sets. Um, so I got one of each. You've got the roses. You've got the owl. You've got the birdhouse with the bird and you got the feathers. And it comes with the little ink pads as well. I was shocked when I saw these. I immediately started grabbing uh, because I've never, these have never come to any of my stores. And let me tell you, I go to a lot of different stores. At least, there's at least 10 Dollaramas that I go to. So, to find these in a new store, I was all for that. Um, these are $2 each, and it shows you at the bottom how to do the stamps, how to stamp it so that it comes out good. So, there is that. I found, I found this. Um, it's foam bath. My youngest likes to take little bubble baths whenever he takes a bath and uh, so instead of using the shampoo to put bubbles I figured I'd get this it's goat's milk vanilla I think something like that it's goat's milk I know that um, but it says it's got more foam and it's a dollar fifty and it says it's made in Canada so there you go oh and there's a uh, 
it's one liter so I mean it's it's a pretty good size they had other uh, scents there as well but I just decided to grab the plain goat's milk um, got some socks for my husband again I don't see a lot of this stuff in my stores um, there's I mean there's stuff there but it's not the same I don't know if you want to say quality or brand or whatever but these there was two pair there's two pairs for uh, shoe size 7 to 11 they're three dollars and they're dress socks so I thought if he liked them and they worked out good to get some more from that one store we'll see found some ribbon I had never seen in any of my other stores before uh, they're saying it's textile ribbon they have two meters on each for $1.25 and you've got it's like a, a light pink or coral color with the flowers and then you've got the darker roses on here or darker flowers so I thought those were really pretty so I grabbed one of each and then I found these again had not seen these before um, there's only one meter on these but you've got the cream and the white lace and these were a dollar fifty they had the thinner rolls as well but I wanted to get some of the bigger one because I have some of the thin one right now so I went with the larger and when I run out I'll just restock got some paper flowers there's 12 pieces for $1.25 um, they had the greens in here they have the reds, the pinks, and then the blue and green. So I grabbed one of each that they had. Um, I did grab some stationary stuff. They had Bic pens there. Um, these were... 250 I believe let me see got my receipt right here um, maybe yeah 250 they were 250 for a pack of five but because they're Bic I didn't mind paying a little bit more so I figured I would try these as well I'm going through, I go through pens like crazy, so I'm always searching for pens on my desk. It's insane. Um, I found these. They had these in black and in just the regular pencil color, the like brownish color. Um, but they're graphite pencils, studio brand. There's 12 in here. They're already sharpened, and it says that it's got a latex free eraser. For two dollars so I thought you know what I'm gonna try that why not see how it works I'm not a drawer at all I don't I'm not an artist or anything like that but I mean I'm gonna see how good of a pencil it is so okay the next thing I got I'm gonna set that to the side the next thing I got some masks I've been having some issues uh, with my face, so <laughs> that sounds horrible, but like I have like peeling skin on my nose all the time and it's annoying. And then, you know, of course, there are certain times where I get, I break out with acne. So I wanted to try these masks and see how well they work and if it helps. So I got a pomegranate an oatmeal, a cucumber, and a mango. And the mango is for purifying, clarifying, and cleansing. The cucumber is for deep clean, smoothing, and moisturizing. 
The oatmeal is relaxing and nourishing, and it says it's self-heating, so that's pretty interesting. And then the pomegranate is deep, clean, and antioxidant. So I thought I'd give these a whirl, and they were only $1.50. So the last thing that I got, could not believe it, new stores are the best, okay, <laughs> they're the best, Easter paper straws. And let's see if I can get this close enough, you can see the little bunnies on the straws. I thought these were adorable. There are 20 straws in each pack for a dollar. You've got three colors. You've got purple, blue, and pink. So I grabbed two of each. Was so shocked when I walked down that aisle and saw the paper straws. I am scoring big time on the paper straws. I've, again, <laughs> I've not seen these in any of my other stores, but today, new store, new items. So I was super excited. Uh, I was going insane. I probably would have continued to go insane, but I had to leave because I was running out of time and needed to go pick up my son from school. It was probably a good thing. Spent less money. So that is my haul. Uh, and yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed and, you know, be on the lookout for new stores. If you find a new store in your, your town, go because it, it's to me it seems the new stores get the better things um or at least it's that's how it's working out for me anyway so there you go you guys have a great day and i will see you all in my next video bye